my YouTube channel. My name is Kelo Khazmi. I'm Khazmi. If you're new here, please do not forget to hit the subscription. <laughs> Subscription button if you are a returning subscriber. Welcome back, gang, gang, gang. Period. Um, welcome to 2021. Happy New Year. This is my official first video for 2021, which is a little bit of mess, but we get in there, we get in there, we get in there. Okay, we get in there. All right. But this feels like um, an extension of 2020, honestly. But anyways, I'm going out for breakfast. It's raining and I'm overdressed for the weather. But it don't matter. Drip is forever, honey. So I decided to buy pizza and coffee so I didn't go out so we're going home to go and eat Okay, 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 okay I'm back at home My makeup Like mask on the No ways Corona must just end So I'm home about to eat and I guess I'll catch you tomorrow. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is the next day today, it's Sunday. I took a long time to get ready, but welcome back. I thought I should do a little setup because yesterday, um, the content failed. I was supposed to go to a restaurant, but I kept on getting lost. And the person I was with was very impatient with me. So we decided, you know what? Just buy pizza and just stay at home. Because anyways, it's raining and I was a little bit overdressed. If you look at my outfit, I was wearing a dress and it was raining. And, 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 and. So I just wanted to say welcome to 2021. I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys and have a heart to heart. That, yo, it is a new year. Even though it didn't feel like a new year when it started, but I'm just happy that we are getting the hang of it. We are, you know, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. And I'm going to be having, I'm having pizza today. Um, it's not going to be a mukbang for real. Like, I'm just having coffee. I know my mouth doesn't look cute, but we'll rectify on that. Yeah, I'm having pizza, guys. I I'm, I'm having all this. Yeah, anyways, um, let me have a bite of my food. Mm. Mm. Like, it's raining every day. Like, what is happening, sis? So, um, I've been feeling like, I don't know if I'm the only one, I've been feeling like, 2021 is just an extension of 2020 not wanting to hop into the new year start doing resolutions resolutions and start um doing my vision boards and all of that i didn't start this year with a bang but i'm just happy that i just kept in i'm back at it yesterday i was busy with my vision board my goals and all of that and i hope you guys hop in too i know that we've been through the most like 2020 was yo what a year hey what a year i'm just happy that we are all here and 2021 is going to be our year we are going to make the best out of it we, we might i think 2020 taught me one thing to never say something like never say never <laughs> never say never and um I, and, and I saw a tweet of somebody saying, a tweet saying um what did that person say she said um one thing about better days they're not coming and i'm like you you know um when you look at it you think this is a negative tweet but if you look at it and i saw another one a person saying that i'm i'm always looking for the next the next i'm always looking forward for the next 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 you're not focusing on the now what about the now why don't you enjoy the now and um i was listening to a preaching in the morning by sarah jakes um where she said that um we are always um yo 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 oh my god your camera rolling 
camera rolling okay um the tweet was saying i saw a tweet that said i feel like i'm constantly constantly worrying about the next part of my life without realizing that i'm right in the middle of what i used to look forward to and i felt that and i feel like this year is a year where you live for now like you you enjoy the now um sarah jake said something like um god sometimes he pulls you out of the situations and brings you back home and you feel like it's a downgrade but it's actually an upgrade because he's trying to prepare your mind for what is coming and he said at the end of his preaching he was like um i wish that the next step reaches you without you even realizing that you're on the next step because you are you're focusing on the now and you're enjoying the now because the now comes with a lesson i mean you oh I just preached like what do you even mean so I, I feel like this year it's going to be a selfish year it's a year whereby you do what you said you're gonna do if it means that you need to do it alone then go for it that trip go for it i'm actually preaching to myself because i'm always canceling trips because of my friend we plan a trip she cancel i feel like oh i can't go there alone and blah blah blah, blah. and um the person i'm currently seeing was like um you know why don't you go there alone i mean and he he was like um i always go, I, I, when i oh when i used to like um me when i oh, come on i'll get it together and he said something like um when he was on international trips he would meet women on trips alone men on trips. people do go on trips alone i don't know what we are scared of but i'm challenging myself that i'm going to go on this occasion and i'm gonna take you guys with me i'm so excited about that and I'm, i just wanted to say happy new year um i hope this year it becomes like i hope this year becomes your year i hope that you achieve all your goals and i hope you plan because i've been planning like yo i got big goals this year that are like big big but they're big for me and please stay in your lane stop comparing yourself i know social pressure people are buying cars people are buying houses people are buying apartments people are moving into new apartments like it's just a lot especially if you like allow social media to consume you so look at it as an inspiration from an inspiration i not from oh we are on the same age and blah 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 i should be doing that blah blah no there's a reason why you're in that situation and god is preparing you for the next step so you need to be mentally and matured enough for that step you might find that you're like oh i want that mercedes-benz but when the mercedes-benz come you're not even ready for that mentally you you're not prepared it's like it's overwhelming you understand what i'm trying to say i hope you understand what i'm trying to say but anyways um happy new year guys i love you guys so much please do not forget to subscribe can we get to thousand subscribers this year and jc they monetize and tell your friends 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 to come watch my youtube channel and guys um for 2021 what would you like to see from me comment down below and yeah man i'll deliver and i'm so sorry that i took so long to upload a video but i've been trying to make videos but they were not just coming together like i did a video and then i i, I bought a wrong um not actually i bought a wrong color intentionally like what happened was i wanted a, a certain shade of foundation and i bought a shade up because that color they didn't have it and it ended up giving me a gray finish and i didn't like the whole video so i had to redo it and i hope you guys are doing well i love you guys so much please do not forget to subscribe and tell your friends to subscribe your boyfriend your ex your mother your sister everybody support the black girl um and what else do i want to say and guys be grateful be grateful be grateful this year i'm gonna be so heavy on um law of attraction i've watched a, i don't know if it's a documentary or what on netflix called um the secret i've watched this interview um that talks about the law of attraction and i'm like i'm going all in my vision board i'm going in and it it emphasizes on don't focus on your worries or your debts or what focus on the positivity and let's say for instance you want ten thousand. focus on getting the ten thousand on how 
we'll get to that when i just say that i got that ten thousand and always manifest that thank you god for that ten thousand and keep on doing you and stop worrying about your debts because your thoughts it creates your life you manifest what you always think about is what's gonna come so that's why like people always say that bad things always happen to me it's because you're always thinking of bad things that's why they are happening to you you are literally attracting them but in some cases it's not always the case but what i'm saying is um let's manifest let's hit those goals let's buy those properties let's buy those cars let us prioritize our mental health mental health before everything your peace before everything do what you want to do okay focus on that okay and um lastly is it lastly uh i would like to say that i love you guys so much and thank you for the support and love that you are showing me it doesn't go unnoticed and i know this year we're going big Go big or go home. Okay, period. P period. So, um, happy new year, guys. This is a short video because my vlog failed yesterday. And I figured that let me sit down and have a heart to heart. Guys, and please prioritize your mental health. Your mental health must come before your friendship, your relationship, your um family ship whatever the case might be please prioritize your mental health your peace because there's a lot going on in this world and you don't want to be surrounded by people who keeps on suffocating you and suffocating you and suffocating you so um prioritize your mental health make sure that you're mentally okay um deal with your past traumas i know like um i realized that i've i've had like um i was traumatized from all the as funny as it is or whatever you might put it that way this relationship of being with toxic people and what what it affects you a lot because like i was seeing triggers like like things from my past relationship reflecting on my new and the person that i was with was like no man why would you think that and i realized that you know what i'm so used to toxic that i think that toxic is everywhere and there are good people out there and don't ever think that um all the good guys are taken not all of them are taken there are good guys out there and i hope you find that good guy and i hope that you find that job i hope that you find that promotion i hope that you buy that car you buy that designer bag i hope that you deal with your past traumas i pray that um good health you know what i mean and um, this year it's good vibes all the way and um guys thank you so much for watching my youtube channel i love you guys so much please do not forget to hit the subscription button and follow me on all social media platform i love you guys so much i can't wait to see you for my next video okay i'm quite excited this is, yeah so i love you bye bye are you not ashamed of yourself are you not embarrassed this is really embarrassing Guys, I want to say last thing that I want to say is dead. Look at yourself in the mirror and tell yourself you're beautiful. Ah, you must tell yourself that you are the that you think you are. You are dead girl. You are dead. Bitch. Yes, you are very beautiful. You're very handsome. You are dead person. Period. <gasps> Am I real? <gasps> you must look at yourself in the mirror. And guys, one last request. Go by the tapping. Ask Gazen, guys. Ask Kapeng. Please. And enjoy the little that we have. And go to that restaurant, guys. 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 It's not that bad. Okay? It's not that bad to have lunch in Sentine that rich. Just go. Just go. Budget 500 or 1000 rand and go there. Go there and eat that steak from Sentine. Period. And tell yourself that you are that bitch because you are. You are that beautiful. You are that girl. Yes. You. Watching this. I love you guys. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Woo! Happy New Year, happy, yeah, happy New Year.